is going on guys welcome back to another video my name is Ron and this is motor tube behind me we have the Hellcat red eye and the Dodge demon and in today's video I'm gonna walk you guys through both cars and tell you guys the differences and similarities in both cars so right here we have the Dodge demon and my Hellcat red eye so right off bat the two differences are the hood you have two hood vents right here and here you have one huge one and also another thing you can notice is right here has the SRT and here has the SRT and the Hellcat logo they also both have the same front lip so these two cars are pretty similar, but they do have their differences. The Hellcat Red Eye makes 797 horsepower with 707 pound-feet of torque, and the Demon makes 808 horsepower with 717 pound-feet of torque, and with race fuel, that knocks it up to 840 horsepower, where the Red Eye is at 797 with 91 and up. But the Red Eye can't take race fuel. You have to tune the Red Eye and change the PCM for it to take race fuel like the Demon. In my opinion, the Red Eye is really a detuned demon honestly at the end of the day there is a few differences that we will talk about in just a little bit but really it is a detuned demon so let's start with the red eye here you got 305s all around and then when we go to the demon it has 315s all around this has drag radials literally front and back where here it has the Pirelli's front and back the worst tires you could possibly put on a car but literally the first manufactured car that comes with drag radials all around literally demon are the first to do it like just look at it they are so crazy aggressive uh, they're also on 18 inch wheels where the red eye is on 20 inch wheels so the demon is wide body and so is the red eye but the red eye you could get an option without it where it's not wide body and that will probably uh, make it about seven thousand dollars cheaper because the wide body kit with the wheels and tires is uh, another seven thousand dollars on top of the price here is the demon logo it is literally a demon in all gloss red and then the red eye is right here it's basically a hellcat symbol with a red eye right in there look at that so when we go back here really there isn't that many differences besides that these are 305s and these are 315s and these are drag radials and these are not so there is also this spoiler you can get with the red eye where it like comes down it's different than the older uh, Hellcats and then on the Demon it comes with this spoiler which is basically like the Hellcat spoiler and it says SRT here and then on here they didn't really put SRT because it would be weird to put it anywhere because you see it's sloped down so you have to put it right here and then nobody can really really see it so now I'm gonna show you guys the interior of both cars my red eye is made pretty similar to the demon because of the options I got like the Alcantara package so that's why they're gonna look pretty similar so let's step inside the demon as you can see it has the leather and then the Alcantara all over here and then here you got the Laguna leather with the demon logo and then you got the suede insert right here you also have the Alcantara steering wheel also another thing is the dash it's in white and it says 200 on here so let's look into the demon uh, options here you go to drag options it has the race cool down line lock shift light launch control um, here it says activate launch control and then you got drag mode that and then you click OK you have custom mode and then you have auto and then uh, yeah that's the three modes it has on this car so as we step into the red eye you got leather here and then Alcantara right here and then again same thing you got the Laguna leather right here and then the suede insert also says SRT and then the Hellcat logo and I also got the Alcantara steering wheel because that's the package that I wanted and then if you look at the dash it's red and then on the Hellcat red eye it says 220 so the red eye options you got track sport custom auto and then the race options right here you have launch shift light race cool down line lock pretty similar to the demon so now let's look at what's under the hood of both of these bad boys so here we got the demon the red eye let's start with the demon first so as you can see has the demon logo right here and then 
it's all red if you can tell right there it has a red block that's how you really can tell between the demon and a regular hellcat you have the intake right here you have the air grabber as you can see it goes right into this right here and then it says air grabber right here and yeah that's pretty much it you got 808 with 93 840 with race fuel but now let's move on to the red eye it's gonna look pretty similar so here you have the srt red eye right there and then we have pretty much the demon intake and then here is kind of like the air grabber except it goes into these two vents and then you got a green belt and then if you guys look closely there is the red block because this is exactly what's in that literally you have the demon blower you have the demon engine ev everything the block everything that is on that car is right here on the red eye literally everything so then that brings us to the question of what are the differences between these two cars well there's a few well first the demon has drag radials all around on 18 inch wheels so obviously 18 inch wheels it'll help you hook better than 20 inch wheels also has the demon springs um, which basically you know transfers the weight to the back to where they could do a wheelie also the demon comes with a crate with a different PCM a different tune where you could run race fuel the red eye doesn't and also on top of that I believe the suspension on a demon is a little bit different to where it makes it run the 9.6 that they claim to run which really doesn't happen that much I rarely seen anyone get in the nines with it all stock most people that did had to literally change the wheel setup on the back and then put skinnies and then they were able to run like a 9.9 usually I've been seeing them run anywhere from a 10.2 to a 10.5 literally consistently that's what they've been really running on race fuel the demon also has a trans brake so you can load up more on the demon so you can launch it which is why it launches so hard where the red eye doesn't and then the demon claims 965 at 140 miles per hour and then they claim the red eye does a 10.8 at 131 miles per hour but a friend of mine just did a 10.5 at the track while it's completely stock so as you can see that's pretty close to what the demons do without the race fuel but now i'm going to talk to you guys about all the similarities that they share literally it's a long list of similarities that they share so the demon has 25 major component upgrades over the 18 regular hellcats and then the red eye has the exact same engine from the demon it is a 6.2 liter hemi with a 2.7 liter supercharger. The Demon and the Red Eye are on 14.5 PSI of boost, 3.9 PSI at launch, and up to 55% more torque via torque reserve. They both have SRT power chillers and after run chillers, which basically cools the car down using the AC unit. Also has a high steel strength steel prop shaft, 15% stronger. Also has a 41 spline half shaft, which is 20% stronger. They both have heated treated die cast aluminum drive housing, which is 30% stronger. They also both have two dual stage fuel pumps. They both also have a high stall torque Converter. They both come with 8-speed auto transmissions. The Demon comes with a 309 rear gear ratio and the red eye comes with a 2.62 or a 309 rear gear ratio depending on which one you want when optioning one out the demon and the red eye both come with line lock launch control electric power steering torque reserve the demon has four piston brembo brakes up front while the red eye has six piston brembo brakes up front the reason for that is because the smaller wheels that are coming on the demon the demon also has a demon specific lightweight suspension with unique geometry with hardcore drag racing hardware which is uh, what's making it run the nice second run that they're claiming it does so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna turn both of them on we're gonna hear the differences if there are a difference in the way they wind the way the supercharger winds and then I'm gonna show you guys the way the exhaust sounds on both of these cars
you guys heard it. Let me know in the comments below what you think is louder. I think the demon was a little bit louder and a little bit more aggressive than the red eye. Also, another thing I want to mention that the demons are numbered. They made 3,000 in America and the 300 in Canada. That's why they're a little bit more rare where the red eye are not numbered. The demons right now are going anywhere between 130 to 140, 150 they're selling for. Brand new, they were about like 89 and up. Depends what options you get where the red eye is, uh, my spec is $95,000 spec. So they're pretty similar in price. The only thing is that the demons are now rare because they don't make them anymore and that they're numbered. So the uh, prices have skyrocketed. And I think they're gonna remain up there just because they're numbered. So in America, only 3,000 made. And they write it on the dash of what number your demon is. So last thing I wanna show you guys are the keys to both cars. So this one says demon. And then this one has the Hellcat logo with the red eye. Well, all right, guys, that is it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Um, I've been trying to get this video done for you guys for a little while because these two cars are very, very special because a lot of people always wonder what the differences between these two cars are. And well, I wanted to show you guys. So I hope you guys learned something in today's video. So with that being said, I'm gonna let you guys go. So if you guys like today's video, give it a big thumbs up. If you're new to this channel, smash the subscribe button, turn your notification bell on to stay up to date with the videos and be part of the family, and I will see you guys on the next video. Peace out, and have a good day.